guys, it's Tanya Peterson with John L. Scott Market Center and Next Level Real Estate, and I am so excited to tell you all about my amazing stager. She literally is the one that makes my houses shine. Without her, without you, I couldn't get my houses to look as gorgeous as they are. And I've had a lot of you guys comment about how beautiful my houses look. And it's her, it's Jamie Davis. She's <laughs> phenomenal and she Thank has you. been doing it for a while now with a lot of agents. Yes. So, how did you get started in staging? I was always intrigued with it, loved it. It was always one of those things where you're like, oh, that'd be so fun to do, but uh, never jumped on it until we had kind of a life shift about mm -hmm. four years ago. And I said, you know what, let's go, let's do it. So I took that leap of faith and here I am today. Killing it three years later, still loving it. You are. And you, I mean, so you just kind of like reached out to a couple agents that you knew because mm -hmm. I found out about you doing this from another agent. Yeah. So it was kind of a weird conversation. I was at one of my kids' basketball games and kind of in between like friends and my friends were saying, hey, this guy needs to stage his property. And I was like, oh, I can do it. I stage. And then I was like, oh my gosh, like I just did that. <laughs> and he was like, okay, cool. And that's how it all got started. And it kind of with, you know, a lot of the same. Uh, agents in the same office, word spreads. And so I've just been super blessed and fortunate. I've got, you know, my core, five to 10 of my heavy hitters, I call you guys, that <laughs> keep me busy and keep everything solid. So yeah, it literally started from just, let's try it and see what happens. And it's been awesome. It's It's been exciting to watch you from the very oh, beginning to now. And it's like, I mean, yeah. before you weren't as busy, and now it's like, oh, yeah. I got to check with my stager to find out when I can put sure. you on the market. Right, right, yeah, and it's, <laughs> it's yeah, and that's how it's kind of just unfolded, and so it's been it's been awesome. I love it. every time I stage a home, I'm just like excited, like this is fun. It's oh, fun. we love it. I could not do it. So when I have you go meet with my clients, mm -hmm. so what? How is the process? What do you do? And can you explain to everybody like? So there's two different basic stages. There's a full stage, which is what we did today. Vacant property. I go in, bring all of my staging items in, and it's top to bottom, all the rooms done, usually the master living, dining, bathrooms, and kitchen. And then there's a partial or a full stage where I work with the sellers. I go in, talk to them about, hey, what can we take down? What furniture do we need to move? Get this stuff off the counters and kind of declutter, organize their property. And then I bring in my items to do a soft kind of light stage using their current furniture, those kind of things, and get the house ready for pictures and ready to show. Wow. Yeah. And that's a really, it's really kind of, I think, takes the pressure off the agent of being mm -hmm. like, hey, we've got to take down grandma's photo. Sorry, we've got to move the Afghan. We've got to, right. it lets me be the bad guy and say, this is what we need to do. Clear it out and let's get going so that we can get the house current. Yes. That, I appreciate it because I also, I do tell my friends, I'm like, she's the bad guy. I know. <laughs> She's yep. going to go in and tell you what you need to yep. get rid of and pack and, and move and everything like that. Yes. So I totally appreciate that. Mm -hmm. um, roughly, how many agents do you normally work with and how many stages can you do like in a in a week or in a day or I mean, I have worked with well over 20. But like I said, I've got, you know, my five to 10, like you guys, like you heavy hitters that are usually stage the majority of all your properties. Um, I have staged two properties in one day. It was a little much, but because it's just my husband and my son that do the moving. So it's, we work together. It's a total family run thing. Um, but I try and average if I could, you know, two a week, but I'll take whatever I can get. And if I can fit you in, I'm going to fit you in. Obviously with a partial or a soft stage, it's a lot easier because I don't need to trailer up and I can do it, you know, load everything pretty much in my car and get everything over to the property. So um, it, it depends, but I usually will try and squeeze you in if I've got time. <laughs> I appreciate that. <laughs> and then usually all the stuff stays in the house for about 30 days, right? 30 to 45. And as the market kind of shifts, like we kind of have to navigate through that with agents. And there's certain properties that you know that are probably going to not sell quite as fast as some of these. And so I'm open to, you know, working with you guys as far as time. Um, but the average stage is 30 to 45 days. You know, we're not in the same market we were last year where things were flipping in five minutes. So right. things are sitting a little longer. So I'm, you know, pretty open to negotiating when it comes to the days on the market and the days, how long we're going to keep it staged. So perfect. Yeah. So what is the, like the fee basis or how do you I, like, charging you know, them? Yeah. Like, and it just kind of depends on, um, I'm, you know, I have a pretty much a base price I start at mm -hmm. and that way I know it covers everything on my end of things. 
Um, it just depends on the work too of the property. I try and keep them super affordable for my agents because they come back and you guys, if you can afford to do it, we're going to stage it. We're both happy and we both, you know, have success there. Um, the price point always changes. My soft stages and partial stages are usually around 850. Right. Um, and then my, my full stages have started around 1850 and kind of go up from there, depending on the scale of the project, the size of the home. And that's one thing I take pride in is I preview all of my properties because every home has character. Every home is different. And, you know, like I told you today, am I fighting with wallpaper? Am I fighting with, you know, old carpet? So every single property has its own character that I need to stage and pull accordingly to kind of obviously for the era of that home too. You know, we've got a lot yeah. of mid-century modernists that are really popular right now. And so being able to go in, take pictures, and then I pull from my inventory with what I think best fits the house. That's awesome. Yeah. Do you think you'll ever grow your business and bring in more people to help you? As uh, There's moments where <laughs> I say yes. And then, you know, the overhead and stuff, I, I don't know. I've There's been days where I'm like, okay, I need to warehouse and like, we're going to do this. Um, but I've been able to keep up and I've been able to do it, you know, floating this and transferring furniture here. And so knock on wood, um, it's something that we've been able to manage right now. But at any point in time, yes, um, I think that it slowly starts to get there. And then you're like, oh my gosh, this is really crazy. And then it's big. So it's just a matter of, of us, I guess, kind of taking that leap of faith and moving right on. And it's hard because I'm a perfectionist and I like to do everything myself. And I don't think anyone can do as good a job as I can. So that for me um, is where I kind of, everything is in the details. So. Well, you are amazing. Thank and you. you make every single one of my properties yeah. shine. And I could not, would not have done the amount of work I did last year without you. Thank you. So I just wanted to introduce her to all of you so that you know the famous Jamie behind every single one of my staging <laughs> houses. I love to stage my houses and I usually incorporate that into my commission so that I'm paying for it because staged houses really truly do sell so much faster and so much more. Yeah, I think it's like a 50% yeah. uh, faster uh, on the, I just was watching the show today and they said that they sell 50% faster and usually 20% higher Yeah, cost-wise. Yeah. They do. It, just, it sells the dream and it allows the seller to walk in or the buyer to walk in and go, this is what the potential of this house is. Like, I can do this. This is somewhere I can get down the road. Exactly. It's simple. It's clean. It's elegant. It's yeah. It's got a good flow to it and you just, can, you just feel comfortable. It's homey. Mm -hmm. So, yeah. Thank you so much. Thank you for everything and for like believing in me and being behind me and you're part of my success too. So Absolutely. I appreciate you and the whole industry has just been, it's fun. We work in a really fun industry. We do. Yeah. So we're lucky. And so we I get think. to see a lot of things yeah. and a, you know, a lot of different designs. Mm -hmm. And I mean, my gosh, you came and helped me stage my own house. <laughs> yes, I know. I'm like, hey, let's get it done. But every, it said every single house and every single person has character mm -hmm. and they want different looks. And so. It's fun. It's always different. Just like selling a different property. Every property is different. So has anybody asked you to come and help them design their house? Yes, I have. I've done quite a few interior design jobs. It's just for me, I prefer staging um, just because it's like that instant gratification for right. me. And um, I love doing design. It's just a much longer process. Right. And so I get impatient with myself of like, okay, like let's get this done and we've got to figure it out. But um, I have to remember I'm working with clients when it comes to design. Right. So it's their design, it's their choices. And so we kind of have to learn to mesh those and, you know, current relevant styles. So um, I, I think for staging, it's a lot funner for me because I just get to go in and do my own thing. I don't have to worry <laughs> about anyone's opinion because I'm like, well, that's what's going to go there. So exactly. but yeah, I do do some interior design, but I usually, you know, like I said, it's just for clients that they know, let's just go in and have fun and get your house dialed in. Yeah. yeah. Thank, Thank you. Yours. Yeah, absolutely. Thank you.